It's day 242 and it's time to meet another one of my friends. So without further ado, please welcome to the screen actor, singer and fan of Monica Seles. Yes, it is. <gasps> You and Martin. Hello, boss. How are you? Oh, darling, I want to know how. Well, I want to know how you are, but I, more importantly, I want to know how Monica Schellers is. Do you know <laughs> if she's alive? She's still alive. She's, she even had a comeback. She like won like three games. <laughs> <laughs> of what did we win? Well, you know why. You know why I said that because you and I were such huge tennis fans. We used to get together and watch Wimbledon and drink champagne and eat strawberries. Now forget what we were watching. (laughs) (laughs) This is not the nine o'clock news. (laughs) But Subaka is on both of them for some reason. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. How lovely to see you. Oh, you too, my friend. You too, my. So friend. you're. Um, I'm calling you in. Uh, in Queens, in New York, right? I'm um, in Queens, in New York. I am at the epicenter of America's COVID-19 outbreak. Literally, the hospital that was on the news that went mad and everybody was dying horribly is five blocks from my house. So. Okay. Yeah. So well done. Well done all. <laughs> <laughs> Something to be proud of. <laughs> Hashtag proud. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah. you're still there. I am still here, yeah, yeah. And I have my own lovely home now with books that you probably can't see, but I have books. I can um, see books. I can see books. I also have something else. This, you might be, do you remember these days? That's me, you, and dear Becky Hall. You see well, my own head is superimposed on the picture. Oh my God, I'm so young. I have hope. I have hair, I think. I There's some know. hair. And, I mean, you were never that young, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, Ian Morton, you and Morton. Oh shit, I've got. <laughs> I know. We'll call me old things these days. <laughs> okay, okay, then we'll carry on. You and Morton, I've got three questions for you. Are you ready for your first? I am. You and Morton, what is your recollection of our first meeting? Uh, well, honestly, I think in, our, in, our, in the early days, I, I don't really remember meeting you because I had that Beatles bowl cup and it was in my eyes from 1994 to 1996. I remember hearing you were always quite loud. <laughs> um, but, uh, but, in fact, we're not even using Skype to do this recording. <laughs> I can hear you in America, for goodness sake. Um, but that's not to say that I don't have any memories of you. And my particular is we used to live together uh, in uh, Stratford, in East London, and you had a beautiful wingback chair, which I was <laughs> allowed to sit in until recently when I got myself one. <laughs> Thank you very much. And mine comes with a footstool. So. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know, but you remember why nobody was allowed to sit on it? It's because we had a house guest that wouldn't leave and they had their period on one of my best chairs. Do you, were you there when that happened? No. It no. was very unfortunate. In fact, in fact, I think it was an American uh, girl. She was somebody's niece. They came to stay and they were there forever and they kept phoning home on my phone bill. And this really expensive wingback chair that was by the phone, and th- this poor girl who was homesick, who nobody knew, who nobody liked, who nobody wanted to be there. Oh, she, no. uh, it, was a, it was a white and blue striped um, chair uh-huh. and she uh-huh. had an accident on it whilst making a very long phone call abroad. And I went apoplect. <laughs> <laughs> that does not surprise me. And now it's put me right off that chair because that chair used to remind me of Pacers. Do you remember Pacers? Striped Do you mean the sweets? Yeah, yeah, I'm not going to see him now. Mm-hmm. No, no. Well, next time you put a pacer in your mouth, just think about that. Oh, so. God. Are you ready for your second question? Yes. <laughs> you and Morton, how are you keeping creative at this time? Well, was this a normal time? I am playing King George in the musical Hamilton on the old Broadway. And you're I've still been doing that old rubbish. Good three Hamilton. years. Three years. I mean, uh, this, yeah. is the, this is the cushiest gig in the world. I saw it in London and uh, I didn't actually know that you were doing it because we're not very good at staying in touch and telling each other what we're doing, are we? And I went to see it in London about a year and a half ago and I didn't know anything about Hamilton. And on this guy comes near, probably end of act one, he's done nothing, he's been, he comes on one big number, buggers off again. And I was like, this is the part I was born, why aren't I playing this role? (laughs) 
This is the laziest bit of musical theatre casting. <laughs> <laughs> yes, well, I've always been cast in the lazy one. <laughs> it is um, a great part, though, and you are great in it, I have no doubt. You're right. People tell me, other actors tell me, and audience members, that I have the best job on Broadway. Um, and what they mean by that is I have the easiest job on Broadway. <laughs> <laughs> you do come on three times, but you sing the same song with different lyrics. So I've forgotten the words. Even in nine minutes of stage time, I've absolutely <laughs> forgotten the words. <laughs> but everyone's in the front row mouthing along, so you can just look down and watch 85-year-olds or 8-year-olds. They all know the words. <laughs> but sadly, with COVID, obviously, I'm not doing that. We're closed until March of next year, I think. And are you furloughed or are they paying you or have you been fired? What's the situation? Well, right now we're on unemployment. We'll probably be able to return to our contracts. But I'm not really worried about returning. If it comes back, I believe we'll go back. But but right now we're, we're on unemployment. But I go to school. I'm doing two bachelor's degrees at the same time. <clears throat> I'm doing a wow. bachelor's in history. I know. I'm, gonna, I'm doing a bachelor's in history and a bachelor's in sociology. I'm in my third year. And do you know, in the UK, we are waiting um, with bated breath. Uh, I think by the time this comes out, it will be on Disney Plus, the Broadway version of Hamilton. Are you in the Disney Plus um, oh, performance? That's, no, that's the original cast with Lynn manuel oh. and Jonathan playing the king. He's really good, though. Oh, OK. <laughs> Probably better than I, what I am. So. <laughs> well, so that's good. very gracious of you. Uh, You've no. changed since I saw you last. <laughs> Your third question, you and Morton, is what are you looking forward to doing that you can't do at the moment? Well, honestly, I have been, uh, probably much to the chagrin of many people, I've been doing most of what I always have done. I go hiking a lot. I love to hike. I was on a road trip when this thing first kicked off. I was in New Mexico and Arizona for a month. Um, you know, I'm doing my schoolwork. I, I literally, I think for me, it's like really simple things like eating in a restaurant. I mean, that sounds so boring, but I don't cook. I'm starving to, not that you can tell by my cheeks, but I'm starving to death here. <laughs> I, I, can't, I can't even make an egg. <laughs> it's just... <laughs> Eating is one thing I'm looking forward to. Um, you need a chicken first, by the way, for the egg. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> can't make an egg. <laughs> <laughs> I know what you mean. Yeah, just someone to bring me stuff. Yeah. And, uh, and who has to be nice to me. Right. That, <laughs> that would be lovely. I mean, look, it's a weird time. You know, you live in the real world. Um, America is going through some stuff right now, and it's really hard for me to sort of publicly, even privately, have any issues because, you know... They're so much bigger the, the, uh, for, the, for other people. Yeah, yeah, exactly. They're so much bigger for other people. And, and, and so it feels almost frivolous to say what I just said. But, uh, but you know, I think, I, I think what I would like to see after this, for me personally and for everyone else, is that we don't go back to normal. I think what I'm missing is the opportunity to to not be normal. <laughs> and right now, everyone just wants to be normal again. Yeah. No thanks. What? You. What is that? <laughs> <laughs> Listen, we are running out of time, but guys, don't forget to press the subscribe button for more content like this. Now, sadly, my oh, it's been so nice to see Hi. you. <laughs> My dear friend, you and Morton will not be with us tomorrow. Boo to tomorrow. But I will see you all tomorrow. If we're safe. Oh, my God. He's a pro. No wonder he's on Broadway. I love you. <laughs> Bye. I love you. Take care.